Have you ever wondered how expensive it was to run a red light therapy panel? It's something I hadn't really thought about until recently, so I decided to find out. My daily go-to panel is a monster Biomex 900 quad setup. This has 1,200 LEDs, it's, it's massive. And it got me thinking, I was like, how much am I actually spending here every time I use it? So be sure to stick around because at the end of the video, I'm gonna reveal exactly how much that setup is costing me personally. But I'm also going to be looking at a bunch of other popular panels including this moderated DAP that I have here beside me. So first up, what I did is I went out and bought a power meter. Now what this does, it tells you how much watts any particular appliance you plug into this is drawing from the wall. Now I've used this meter on a bunch of panels. First up was the Mido Adapt 300 with 72 LEDs. Then we had the Biomax 300 with 100 LEDs. Next was the larger Juice Solo 2.0. Then we had the Mido Red Mido Pro 1500. Finally, I tested the Rojo 3000. This had a whopping 600 LEDs. Now you can see the wattage figure for each of these panels on screen. Now what these figures mean is if you left these panels running for an hour, that's how many watts it would use. Now once we have these figures, we can run some simple math. So let's look at the first panel the Mido Adapt 300. It has a draw of 120 watts. That means over one hour of use, it uses 120 watts, which is the same as 0.12 kilowatts. Now, if we assume we use this panel for a session time of say 20 minutes, and we do four sessions a week, 52 weeks of the year, this works out to be 69.3 hours of use in a year. I'm gonna make things simple and just round this up to 70 hours a year. So now we have the total amount of hours we use this panel in a year, and the amount of electricity it uses per hour. We can then multiply these together to get the annual electricity use, and that is 8.4 kilowatts. All right, now for the fun stuff, we then convert this power usage into dollars. Okay, so here's where it gets a little bit tricky because electricity rates vary all throughout the world. So what I did is I went to globalpetrolprices.com. They have uh, average electricity rates per country for 2022. So I used these figures for the following calculation. The average power price in the USA was 0.0. 175 US dollars per kilowatt. So now using that figure, we can say that using this Mido Adapt 300 four times a week, 20 minute sessions at a time, in a year will cost you a whopping, wait for it, $1.50. And don't worry, I checked the numbers three times, maybe four, because I thought this is crazy. It's way lower than I expected. Okay, so what happens if you live in another country with much higher electricity prices. I plugged in the numbers for Australia and it worked out to be $2.70, but that's Australian dollars. Finally, what about the UK? Because their electricity prices are a lot higher. Well, £3.30 for a year's use, running this panel four times a week, 20 minutes at a time. It's pretty good. Hey, so really quick, if you're enjoying this video, please hit the like button below. And also, if you find this entertaining, useful, helping to make you purchase a real light therapy panel, perhaps, uh, be sure to hit the subscribe button as well. If you are going to buy a panel, use discount code Alex, A L E X. It will save you 5% or more and uh, helps me to continue putting out content like this. All right, thanks. All right, this is a small panel. So, what about the larger ones? Well, let's have a look at that. The Biomax 300, $2 a year. The Juve Solo 2.0, $3.10 a year. The Mito Pro 1500 with 300 LEDs, $4.90 a year. The Rojo 3000, which I recently reviewed. Now this thing was very powerful and was drawing nearly 2000 watts. It is a beast, but even running that over a year would only cost you about $23. So all of this is quite surprising, right? What about if you're in the commercial space and you're looking at one of these panels or beds or setups for regular client use? Well, I crunched some numbers here. And this is what I came up with. Let's assume you're running an epic setup that's drawing 4,000 watts. This is going to be huge, right? It's going to be pretty elaborate. And let's say you're running it for five hours a day. You know, you've got 10 sessions, half an hour each, uh, five times a week. It works out to be 1,300 hours a year. When you crunch the numbers, it returns a figure of $910 a year. Remember, this is for a commercial user with quite a big setup, not your typical home setup. In all honesty, that's nothing. I mean, so seriously, it's it's not a lot. So now that we know that running a red light therapy panel is not expensive at all, you're probably keen to get the biggest and baddest setup you can afford, right? In that case, check out my own personal red light therapy setup. This is the Biomax 900 quad setup. It's got a whopping 1,200 LEDs and it's only costing me $18.50 a year to use this four times a week. So despite its hefty price tag, at least I can rest easy at night knowing it's not costing me a bomb to run.